Hello everyone, today we are in the capital city of Ljubljana. It's again 4 a.m. I am here because I just left my parents because they're going on a vacation. It's pretty dark and that's why I will now move to Rediama Castle. That's a castle built inside a cave and uh, we will see each other when we are there. We just arrived, it's pretty dark still. The castle is just behind me but you cannot see it yet. So it's about one hour till sunrise. I will just wait around, eat a snack and then we'll see each other again. I will start taking some exposures. Uh, it will be a panorama again. I already set up a tripod with a camera. One thing really important with panoramas is that the tripod and the camera need to be really really leveled otherwise you will have some problems with stitching. Uh, another thing it is that if you are using polarizers, especially on a wide angle lenses, it's quite common to get a nasty vignette in the sky. 13 seconds on f5.6 ISO 160 and let's see what we'll get. We have some time to kill, so let's walk around. I will show you around the area. It is in this vlog that I wanted you to show the importance of light. The first photo that we took before, uh, it was taken during almost night. Then we took a photo uh, at the sunrise when the st sun wasn't shining on the castle yet. Now we are waiting for the optimal light and then I will wait for the harsh light, the midday light, and you will see the difference. You cannot help yourself but wonder how these things were made. It's just amazing. It is cold and I just realized I sat on a wet bench. Good one. I think now it's the best light. Can you see the light just hitting the top of the castle up there? I think that's the sweet spot. So we are on 1 40th of a second f5.6 ISO 64. Good stuff. You can see almost half of the castle is covered with sun now. I will take an exposure and I will show you the difference. Now we are on 1 1 60th of a second f5.6 ISO 64. Now the light will be worse and worse, so it's no point waiting. Once the castle is fully lit with the sun, the depth will be gone, the texture will be gone, and we will be long gone. I would like to thank you for watching this video, I really hope you liked it. If you did, please consider subscribing down below and I will see you around. I challenge you to revisit one of the spots where you've taken a midday sun photo, retake the shot and tell me how it turned out in the comments.